today we are discussing about static binding and next day we are discussing about dynamic binding so what is binding connecting a method called to the method body is known as binding there are two type of binding one is static binding one is dynamic binding what is static binding when type of the object is determined at compile time it is known as static binding so whenever the object type it is rectified by the compiler at the compile time so it is known as static binding if there is any private final or static method in a class there it is a static binding so suppose there is a variable variable have a type in data equal to 30 integer is a type of the data variable it is known as um, variable type next is reference who have a type class dog inside main method inside dog d1 dog d1 means dog type of uh, object is d1 d1 reference with dog type of d1 is a type of dog suppose dog d1 equal to new dog constructor so d1 is a dog is a dog constructor d1 the reference value of the object and dog is a type of object so next is our static binding example so here is class dog inside class dog there is private method void it print dog is empty next is main method there is dog d1 equal to new dog constructor there is d1 dot it so there is d1 dot it method so whenever this method will be called the it um, method will be uh, called and dog is eating so there is no uh, confusion about the type because there is only one class dog d1 and there is only only one method d1 dot e there is no overloading concept there is no overriding concept because of only one class is there so this will be printed dog is eating so previously we are discussing about binding next is static binding next is variable next is reference so um, previous days we discussed about our reference variable object type class type stamps final keyword there is a another runtime polymorphism also there so there are many type of things inside the java so inside the java we previously known that the data overriding data variable overriding is not possible in java only method overriding is possible in java also inside java there is constructor overloading is possible method overloading is possible java has entered many uh, application in our daily life so it is many more important than um, our thing so this is our entire discussion of st uh, static binding and this is our example of static binding so here is that our examples